I thought I did pretty well in Pop Idol, made the final, but uh, stumbled on the last hurdle, unfortunately. I'll go, I'll go, I'll go. I found that hard. And so my main drive for this is to prove to the British public that I am a winner. Are you happy with where you are? Guys, stop, stop. Guys, this isn't working. What the f are we doing? Swap with me, Siva. Swap me, swap with me, get in the back. At the back. I... Right. Oh. Come on, guys, see there, hurry up. Can you not do the front? No, because he's struggling at the front. Three, not, and I two, one, no, okay, up we so go. This ah. march forward. With number 14, Siva struggling. Number seven, Gareth, takes ah. over as leader. March forward, one, two, one, two. It takes a lot for me to lose my temper. However, sometimes that helps my speech impediment. One, two, come on now. If I'm really pushed to my limits, I seem to then be able to speak fluently through shouting at people. One, two, one, two, one, two. Hopefully they'll push me to my limits. Let's go! Team Alpha. Put it down. Are the first to reach the finish line, winning the task. Stand up and proud. Look what we've done. All the way in, do not drop that boat again. Team Bravo. Finish three minutes behind. <sighs> Team Bravo. <laughs> I was going to say under the command of 14, but let's say under the lack of command from 14, it fell to an absolute shower of sh Number seven. He took control of the situation and he did get a grip of them. Worth a chat tonight, you think? Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Should we bring you in? Sit. You've been quite quiet, almost a greer man, but I seen a change and then watching you confidently go about your business, it was yeah. impressive to see. Just tell us a little bit about yourself. I don't know a lot about you. I'm from um, uh, Bradford in Yorkshire. Um, I know Bradford. Um, for me, um, 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 growing up was hard. Um, uh, um, what family life you mean? No, not school. Um, you know, having a stammer. School is hard. Come on, oh God. Just. Uh, um, verbally abused, physically. <sighs> Come on. During school days. Yeah, just um, lads kind of. Um, lads just holding me down and just, you know, kind of shouting out things, you know, let's, let's, um, beat the words out, okay? And, um, uh, I think that's why I'm here to kind of show myself this time that I am stronger and, um, and that I'm not, hopefully this time I won't break. I think that's why I'm here. But, you know, from what you're saying there, you've, you know, it's made you who you are today. Yeah. How, how did you pick yourself up to then put yourself forward for the TV show? Mum actually forced me to do it. You know, she kind of saw that I had a voice and was like, look, son, you know, you need to, you know, from somewhere find the courage, you know, to kind of force yourself into that situation and... Um, Thank God for your mother. Pushing you into that. Yeah, I'm thankful that she did that because, um, you know, there's lots of other people that I know that have the same issue as me but don't find their outlet. And I think, you know, it's the same with the gym now. You know, I go to the gym because the frustration that I live with um, every day, you know, if I'm not going to get my words out, you know, I, I'm, I'm able to then kind of thrash it out in the gym and that kind of keeps my mindset. Um, Gives you focus. Yeah, yeah, in the right place. You're capable, that's the truth. Don't fucking have any doubt in your mind. No. If I'm honest, you're quite close to front running. So you've got potential, you've got a good chance. Yeah. So hang in there. The longer you're here, the better you'll feel and get out of this. Sure.
we're just going to turn up the heat. Um, the last thing I want to do is kind of um, give up. God! The bullying at school, you know, became just unbearably bad. I've got those, you know, kind of horrendous scars there still. I think if I can get through this course, it would just prove to myself that um, I am strong. And I really, really want to feel I've, I've grown and I've learned and I can handle anything.